KBC. 16 years ago, Molly Smith had a capital idea that comedy, drama, a little song and dance could actually thrive in Juno outside the halls of government. Today, thanks to Molly's dream and some welcome capital from NBA, Juno's Perseverance Theater is a nationally acclaimed reality that delights Alaskans and patrons from around the world. National Bank of Alaska, we specialize in you. It's 11 o'clock. Do you know where your kids are? Live, local, and late breaking from KDLT. Tom McClenahan, Jessica Sampai, Game of Name with Weather, and Dave Chrome on Sports. This is News 7 tonight, Alaska's number one late news. Our top story on News 7 tonight. Juno schools are beginning to make plans for a second high school. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jessica Shambau. And I'm Tom McClanahan. That's our top story tonight. That's because informal projections show enrollment at Juno Douglas High School could hit 2,000 by the year 2000. Dot. The JDHS building's official capacity is 1,200, far below the 1,600 students now enrolled in the high school. About 100 students, however, attend an alternative high school in a separate building. News 7 reporter Jay Conrad shows us for the results. 